Hey guys, so this is going to be a Dollar Tree and Walmart haul. I'm going to do all the Dollar Tree stuff first, and then I'll move into the Walmart stuff. Before I get started, I just wanted to say that if you're not subscribed to my channel, you can go ahead and do that now. So I'll wait a second for you to click subscribe and like the video. It'll notify you every time one of my newest videos is uploaded. I know I haven't been uploading a lot, and normally I don't upload a lot anyways, but especially now with my disability, I've been MIA. So I went to my Dollar Tree, and I did find some cute items and then some items that I needed. I didn't go crazy on the Christmas stuff just yet because, it, to me, it's still kind of early. So I'm just going to start grabbing whatever is closest to me. So the first thing that I have to show you guys is, in fact, a Christmas item, and it's one of these cute little tumblers, and it's got the red truck with the little Christmas trees in the back of it, and then little snowmans. I thought that was really cute. I just got one of those because I still have tons of Christmas tumblers and then the Christmas coffee mugs in the little... Um, gift boxes from Dollar Tree that I haven't even given away yet. So the next item is a cleaning item. It's this Spick and Span multi-surface cleaner in the Wild Lavender. It says lasting fresh scent and it's 22 ounces. I normally don't get low on like toiletries and stuff that I need for the house but lately because I haven't been really going that many places I was almost all the way out of like, you know, multi-purpose cleaner. So I just grabbed this and I need to stock up um, on some better ones too. So then I picked up some more of these Old Spice deodorants, which they get kind of on and off. I've showed these before and when I'm there and they have them, I pick them up. I haven't seen any of the powder Old Spice deodorants there. I only ever see the gels. If they get the powder, I definitely will buy like a ton of them. But Robert uses these. It's the Old Spice Pure Sport. They also get, I think, two other scents, but this is the only scent they had right now. It's 1.7 ounces. It's a really good deal. Jordan can't use the gel. It breaks him out in a rash, so I didn't get him any of that deodorant. I did get him a deodorant, but I got him, um, well, when I get to it, I'll show it to you guys. I picked up two of these Glade lavender and vanilla sprays, one for the bathroom and then one for Robert because he likes to keep scent stuff in his room. In the past, like, year, he's gotten a lot more into, like, wanting candles in his room and smelly stuff, and so... I pick stuff up for him now as well. I picked up another uh, pack of these sanitizing ready wipes. It's the antibacterial hand wipes in the fresh scent. It says alcohol free. You get 50 of them and um, Jordan was sick and then plus I'm not really sick with anything contagious but um, I just wanted some sanitizing stuff. I also got a sanitizing spray. They had these cognac, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, sponges again. They also get these on and off. This is the Every brand. I've bought these a couple times and I actually gave these out last year for Christmas in like little goodie bags. So I decided to get a couple more in case I do some goodie bags for Christmas as well. And then I got another one of these Petty Scrub foot buffers. I actually use this for myself. But I got this one to put away with these as Christmas uh, gifts. This is also in the Every brand. They have both of these at Walmart right now. So if you can find them at Dollar Tree, definitely pick them up. I got this Christmas gift bag. Nothing exciting or special. It's just got the little penguin on it. And then it's got the gift tag. It's in the Voila brand. I have lots of gift bags, but I like to pick some up here and there each time I go. I picked up these super cute gift tags. These are in the Christmas House brand. You get 40 of the self-adhesive gift tags, and this has the glitter on it, and it looks like that. Super cute with the little candy canes and the snowmans. 
double-sided so you get lots of gift tags. I just don't really see the point in buying gift tags from anywhere other than Dollar Tree unless, like last year, I went to Walmart and I found some super cute red truck ones um, for cheap. I got those. I got this pack right here, and it's kind of the same, but it's just got, well, the same color combination and then the glitter, but it's just got different pictures on it. You also get 40 of them. I picked up a pack of the dog treats. This is the Green Briar Kennel Club. They changed the packaging on these dog biscuits, but it's still the exact same ones. It's one pound of the multi-flavor um, biscuits. It's got beef, bacon, chicken, sausage, and turkey flavor in there for one pound and no propylene glycol. That's a really good deal. I got this super cute Christmas sign. It says Noel and it's got uh, the snowman on it. They had a Santa one that I almost got, but like I said, I didn't want to go too crazy yet because I have tons of Christmas stuff, you guys. Like, I can't even decorate with all my Christmas stuff because I have so much of it. But that was way too cute to pass up on. I got two packs of these off-brand pads. And um, these actually looked like a pretty good off-brand. I've never seen these at Dollar Tree before. It says Modest Basics. And it looks like it's supposed to be an off-brand of the Always. It's the Overnight, and they're supposed to be ultra-thin. So I thought 10 for a dollar was a good deal, so I got two of them. So I'll try them out and see how I like them. I picked up one of my Ladies Speed Stick deodorants. This is my favorite deodorant. I always tell you guys that. 1.4 ounces of the deodorant. A pack of the Sesame Street Hushables Baby Wipes, the Shea Butter Made in the USA. You get 72 of them. I picked up a pack of wrapping paper, and I'm not exactly sure on what like color theme I'm going to go with this year for Christmas, so um, I may use this just to wrap like nieces and nephews Christmas presents. Um, that are going to go to other houses, but I try to kind of match my wrapping paper with my Christmas tree. Sometimes it doesn't all match if I see something really cute, a wrapping paper, and I want to use it, but um, I don't think I'll be doing any of these colors, but I did think it was cute for kids' presents. It's in the Christmas House brand, and it is... How many feet is it? 30 square feet of wrapping paper. I got a pack of oops, the Neeson Top Ramen and the Chicken. Nothing exciting. You get five of the three ounce packs of noodles. I got Jordan this Suave deodorant. And I either get him the Speed Stick um, but they've been having this swab, and I think he used it one other time. It's the Active Sport, 1.4 ounces. I needed a new um, shower curtain, like, for the inside. This isn't going to be seen at all. I have a, um, like, fabric shower curtain on the outside, but I like the plastic on the inside because I don't want my fabric shower curtain getting wet, so I just picked up this one. It was the most decent looking one. It's 70 inches by 72 inches. These are very thin and I'm just going to say they're very cheap, but I change them out like once a month. So I don't really care if they're super cheap as long as they block the water because, you know, they start getting like a uh, soap scum on the bottom and I just can't handle that. I think it's disgusting. So I got that. I got this really pretty ceramic apple. And there was only one white one left. I would have got a couple of them. I just thought this was really pretty. I don't do apples, and I don't know what I'm going to do with it. But I just thought it was way too pretty to pass up. They had gold, um, green, I think. I don't remember the colors, but this was my favorite one. My boss told me that um, 
one of the managers bought like a bunch of that color so that's why there was only one left i finally you guys after all these years got a flipping pizza cutter it's the betty crocker pizza cutter nothing special but we get the frozen pizzas once in a while and we always have to use like a butcher knife and it's so hard to cut frozen pizzas with a knife like and i always tell myself get a pizza cutter, get a pizza cutter, and I never do, and I finally got it, so it should be much easier to cut our pizza with the pizza cutter. I picked up some of the SureFresh bags. Jordan started a new job. He works at the Subaru car lot, and um, I've been packing his lunch because, as you know, going out to eat every single day adds up. He will go out to eat here and there, but to save money so we needed more I got the um, slider sill this one has the little thing this one doesn't but these seal up just fine this is nine of the gallon and then this is 15 of I don't know it just says 17.8 centimeters by 20.3 centimeters if you even know what size that is I got some of the Dove soaps they get these um, once again on and off the Dove um, Men Care Extra Fresh. So I got one for Jordan and Robert, 3.17 ounces. And then I just got one of the White Doves, 3.17 ounces for me. I do prefer to purchase these at Walmart in the bigger packs, but you know, in between, just for convenience, I will pick them up. And when I see these ones at Dollar Tree, normally I get a couple of them, but we still have some men's bar soap in there right now. So, and you know what? I actually should have picked up a couple of these because I like to put together um, my own men's Christmas packaging. Like, I'll buy the, um, the two-pack of, like, Dove shampoo plus body wash for $6.98 instead of like a gift pack and then I'll separate all of those I'll do like the three packs of deodorant and then I'll put it together you know myself and it ends up being a little bit cheaper so I probably should go back and get a couple more of those to do that I got this two pack of nail polish and this is gonna just be to put in little um, goodie bags for Christmas. They had lots of really nice color combinations. I thought this one was really pretty. 0 0.5 ounces and it's this really pretty um, pink color and then that glitter color isn't really showing up as true to color on camera but it's a really dark glitter and it's just really pretty and Pure Ice is actually a decent brand for nail polish you guys. I believe they sell it at Walmart and Target maybe. So I got that. I picked up a thing of toothpaste. It's the Crest Baking Soda and Peroxide Whitening Toothpaste in the Fresh Mint. 2.9 ounces of toothpaste. Then I picked up these Christmas socks, which I believe are from last year. And I think I may have even got some of these last year. But um, most Dollar Trees do packaways. So after Christmas... Um, our Dollar Tree, I think, does a week. They do like 50% off, and then whatever they don't sell, they pack away. So you may see some items at your Dollar Tree from last year that you don't see at other Dollar Trees, and that just may be why, because they pack it away. So I got these probably as stocking stuffers. Um, they're the men's um, size 6 to 12. This one says, oh, snap, and it's got the little gingerbread man. And then this one says... Oh, Snow, you didn't, and they're just the little dress socks. This one has the gray heel, and then this one has the gray heel with green, and then this one has black. So I believe that's everything from Dollar Tree. Now I'm going to move into Walmart. I got some Halloween clearance items. There was a decent amount of clearance Halloween stuff, um, but I just got the stuff I liked the most. So I got these super cute... Halloween pumpkin earrings for 40 I think it was 40 cents it was 75% off of everything I think it was 40 cents and I just thought those were so cute with the little rhinestones they also had purple bats but I wasn't really loving the purple bats and plus I decided to save some for other people because you know getting clearance is an awesome deal let me get a drink of my coffee really quick 
my head's pounding as usual. That's what my disease does, the Chiari malformations. It just makes my head hurt like every day. Then I got these um, bags right here. It says celebrate Halloween treat bags with ties. And I think these were like 10 cents they came up to. This was the last pack of the bags or else I would have got a couple of them. You get 20 of the treat bags and I like to put little gift bags together. I got this gift set for Robert for Christmas. It was $9.98. It's the Old Spice. And I was just telling you how I like to put this stuff together myself. But $9.98 for this set is not bad. It comes with the Swagger Body Wash. It comes with the spray and then the Swagger Deodorant. They also had it in like two other scents, a Fiji one. And then they had another set of Old Spice where it came with like the hair pomade the spray and deodorant so I got that and then I got these super cute plates for Halloween you guys for 14 cents each I thought they were gonna be like a dollar each and I had her price check them at the register and she's like 14 cents and I was like heck yeah I'm gonna take them aren't those super cute they're plastic but I think I got six of them one two three four five yeah six of them so I definitely was not going to pass on those. There's so much you could do with these. You could just use them as regular plates or you could use them to like put candles on and decorate with them. These are, it just says Celebrate. I don't know if that's the brand, but I got those. I got, they had Christmas soaps and I just think they use the same scents. They just change it from like, you know, Halloween to Christmas. I got two of the soft soaps in the Autumn Breeze. And I was tempted to get a Christmas one, but we're not to Thanksgiving yet. So I just got the Autumn Breeze, 7.5 ounces, 98 cents each. It wasn't my favorite scent, but I needed them, so I got them. I got one of these little trees for 98 cents in the Black Ice. Nothing exciting about that. I got some Christmas stocking stuffers. I know I do that a lot in my videos. I just can't stand when it gets all messed up. So I got these. These were $2 each. I always do the um, candy canes with Hershey Kisses or the Reese's cups in them. So these, how many ounces are these? These are 2.88 ounces, and I like to buy Christmas candy for the stockings like a little bit at a time because Christmas candy is expensive, and I'm not really fond of doing off-brand. There are a couple of things that I may get off-brand, but as, when it comes to chocolate, I especially don't like to do off-brand, so I got those. I got this for Robert's stocking. It was like $3.88. It's the Jack Link's Teriyaki Beef Jerky. And beef jerky is super expensive, at least I think. It's 2.85 ounces, and it doesn't expire before Christmas, so it'll be good. It expires afterwards. I picked up um, a pack of the Queen Anne Cordial cherries for my Grammy. I get her these every year and wrap them up for Christmas. These were, I believe, a dollar. They're 6.6 .6 ounces, and you get 10 of the Cordial, Cordial cherries. I picked up a bag of the Reese's um, little miniature peanut butter cups, and I believe this was like $2.88, and it is 11 ounces of chocolate. They had a big bag of all name brand chocolate for like $14.88. I was very tempted to get that big bag for $14 because it had so much, and that would be the bulk of the chocolate for... Um, I don't know, maybe two or three stockings. I do a lot of candy in the stockings, but I decided not to. I was like, no. Then I picked up um, these, two of these. These were a dollar each, these Reese's Pieces, and they're four ounces each. And then two of these, a dollar each, M&M's milk chocolate. So one for Robert's stocking, one for Jordan's stocking. And... I think that's it, except for, um, let me grab this really quick. One second, guys. 
if I can get it. So I got this toilet paper. I know toilet paper is nothing exciting, but this toilet paper, you guys, is like the off-brand to Scott. I think it's literally identical to Scott, and it's cheaper. And I know a lot of people hate the thin Scott. I prefer it. I like the thin toilet paper. It lasts a really long time. It doesn't, um, like shed you know I hate when toilet paper sheds this is 1,685.55 square feet for like seven bucks you guys and this will last us a good amount of time it's made in the USA so I know like I said toilet paper is boring but I just wanted to show it to you because it's a really good value you get 16 rolls when I get regular toilet paper one roll like doesn't even last half the day in my house. I don't know why. I hate buying regular toilet paper. Um, excuse me. I have all of the different apps for like Dollar General, Walgreens, and even with the coupons for like two dollars off, it still is not as good of a deal as getting this toilet paper. I just like the off-brand Scott anywhere from Target, Walmart, CVS, anywhere as long as it's a good price, I get it. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this small haul. Um, I'm just trying to make sure I didn't forget anything. I always forget stuff. Um, I definitely have missed you guys. I'm sorry that it's been extra long since I've filmed. It's just this disease is really kicking my butt. And I'm just physically pretty miserable every day, you guys. And I'm really praying that even if it, it's not curable, even if it doesn't go away, that it just subsides somewhat so I can live a normal life. Um, I'm researching more about Chiari and, you know, trying to figure out different things that work for me. So, once again, if you're not subscribed to my channel, you can hit the subscribe button right now. The little bell will pop up. Hit that bell. So then, especially since I don't film all the time, it'll notify you and you'll know. If you enjoy Dollar Tree hauls, go ahead and click the like button. Have a great week, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.